YouTube, so welcome to another episode of Art Supply Sundays. <laughs> so this week I've got a very special eraser to use. <laughs> um, this is an electric eraser. I don't know if you guys have ever heard of them. They're like, apparently like super magic. I've never used one before and I got one to try it out. It's Kokinora. I got it from, um... Hobby Lobby for about 15 bucks. So yeah, this is my first time using it. Never been opened. This is the first time this is opened, guys. This is going to be like a legit unboxing. I hope you enjoy. I did this just for you. Let's see how this works, though. Mm -hmm. They give you a lot of fancy dancy little eraser replacers. They give you a couple of free batteries to go with it. That's always a plus. I don't think there's any in here. I'd assume not. Is this how I get them off on the back? There's a button switch. Okay. So yeah. Okay, so it takes triplets. And I guess that makes sense, but yeah, just in case anyone is curious, takes triple A's. Oh, there we go. I figured it out, guys. You know what they say, C's get degrees. <laughs> okay, I'm just kidding. I'm really actually a good student. Please believe me, guys. I, I really am. I do hard. I do good in my studies. Okay. Oh, okay, so you just press the button to make it go. That's weird. Oh, it just spins around. I don't know if you can see that. It kind of hurts to put your finger on, but I'm um, sorry, that's out of focus, but it just spins around. Okay, let's try this baby out.
now that I have finished my little piece, just so you know, it's a little still life I did of my bonsai that is sitting in front of me. It's a little abstracted, of course. I kind of just did a very high contrast version of it, if you can tell. Um, hopefully you can. Um, but I must say, I am like amazed by this little baby. She kind of sounds a little inappropriate, but <laughs> this baby does the work. It's a little bit loud when you put it on the paper, so like that. Yeah, um, might not be the best to use in quiet areas. Just a heads up if you plan on getting one of your own. Um, but this baby does her work. She's, it's just amazing. I'm sure you could tell when I was doing this, but the way this works, it just totally lifts up that pigment. And it's just really amazing, honestly. Um, I was actually quite surprised how well it worked. Um, I can't say I know really know what I was expecting. Was I expecting worse or was I expecting better? I don't know. But, um, it did a really did an amazing job. I mean, you can still see where the pencil was. And it did leave a lot of shavings, which got stuck to the paper a little bit. But and they're right here all over my bed. Joy. Gross. Get out of here. So... Yeah, but like the way it brought out the white of that paper is actually quite amazing. Like I'd compare this to my Holly Poly Mars, if anything. I mean, it does have the same kind of high polymer eraser on it. So there's that. I would like to know where you get more of these when you run out. I mean, I used, actually used what was out on this just to do what I did, so I wouldn't really suggest it for a full piece, but I mean, if you make a mark that you really don't like, I think this would be amazing to just whip up that mark and it can get right into those little spaces. Um, I mean, another point is it doesn't get super skinny, as you can see up here, the bonsai leaves are supposed to be super, super skinny, but um, it's okay, you can, there is I mean, quite a lot of precision for being a vibrating spinning eraser that, I mean, I don't know if you can see it, but when I was looking at this, when I refilled the eraser, that baby just goes out. <laughs> so, I mean, just that amount of precision of this is, I, I appreciate it. Um, and I didn't find it very hard to use. It's a comfortable hold. It's very, you know, easy to use. They have the button on this, at least on this Kohinoor model. So it goes in. So it's very easy to rest your thumb on and push in on it to get it going. And I mean, I know some, I heard in someone else's video that they had a hard time not using it like an eraser. Which, I mean, I guess it's a very comfortable eraser holder. I mean, it does, I mean, you can see that. It does a really good job erasing just as a normal eraser. If you run out of batteries or anything, you can just, you can still use it. It's just a, an expensive, fancy eraser holder then. But, um, it really did a good job at everything. I am pleased, very pleased. Um, so yeah, I will stop rambling, I guess. And I guess I'll see you guys next week. Starting a new season series. Maybe it'll be on these babies. Maybe it'll be on colored leads. We'll see. Or pens or papers. I have so many ideas of things I want to do for Art Supply Sundays. I just barely explored it yet. I'm mad at myself for putting this off for so long. So, yeah. Here's to the future, guys. Hopefully you keep following the series. Make sure to like, subscribe, 
leave a comment and share it with a friend. So yeah, see you guys next week. Bye.